Long-term effect of pulsed ND laser in the treatment of children with juvenile rheumatoid arthritis, a randomized controlled trial. By Al Shami SM, Bella Atem SM, Abdel Galil AA, Al Shri MA via Fodem Laser Surg. Long-term effect of pulsed ND laser in the treatment of children with juvenile rheumatoid arthritis, a randomized controlled trial. Fodem Laser Surg. 2018 July 17. Authors, El Shami SM, Bella Atem SM, Abdel Galil AA, Al Shri MA. Abstract. Objective, the aim of this study was to evaluate the long-term impact of a pulsed neodymium doped yttrium aluminum garnet, and YAG, laser, high-intensity laser therapy, HILT, in the treatment of juvenile rheumatoid arthritis, JRA. Materials and Methods A sample of 30 children participated in this study, 15 in the laser group and 15 in the placebo group, with a mean age of 10.53 plus minus 1.25 years. Children who were randomly assigned to the laser group received HILT thrice per week for four weeks, plus the exercise program. HILT scanned each knee with 600 J in two phases and 15 J to 10 points for a total of 750 J for each knee. The placebo laser group received placebo HILT plus the same exercise program. The outcomes measured in this study were the pain level by the visual analog scale, VAS, and gait parameters by the gait right registered system. Statistical analysis was performed by ANOVA with repeated measures to compare the differences between the baseline, post-treatment, and 12-week follow-up measurements for both groups. The level of significance was set at P0.05. Results The VAS results significantly decreased post-treatment in the laser group relative to the placebo group and were still improved at the 12-week follow-up. Gate parameters significantly increased in the laser group after 4 weeks of treatment and after 12 weeks compared to the placebo group. Conclusions, HILT, when combined with an exercise program, appears to be more effective in children with JRA than a placebo laser procedure with exercises. PMID, 30,016,193, PubMed, as supplied by publisher. Add DAGs, currently. PubMed, Medicine by Alexandros G. Sfakianakis, 